everyone. Welcome to our music class and you are watching lesson 4 of Music 6. This is Teacher Celeste, your teacher for today. For today's lesson, we will be discussing difference among time signatures. So for lesson three, we already discussed the different time signatures and there's an additional, which is the 6-8. As we all know, a time signature tells us how the music is to be counted. It also tells us the number of beats in every measure. And it also tells us the kind of note or rest that would receive one beat. We mentioned a lot of beats. What is a beat? Or what are beats? In music, beats are the steady pulse that you hear. So just like a human heart, human, human, healthy heart, we have a steady heart beat or a steady pulse. Um, in this lesson, we, mm, we mainly focus on the beat of each measure on in every time signature. So to start with, let's have the 2-4 time signature. So by definition of time signature, 2-4, there must be two beats in every measure and quarter note or quarter rest receives one beat. So I will show you a video clip that will uh, show or that will let you hear a the beat in every measure so before the actual video clip start will start there is a count in of one measure so there's there now you can hear uh beats for one measure before you can see the actual video that will show you the beats So do not be confused on the second measure, why is the arrow down the, that represents the beat only pointed the first um, eight note and then skips in the second and then pointed again to the third eight note. It is because, as we all know, in the 2-4 time signature, eight note receives one half beat, right? So there must be two eight notes to have a one full count. So there. So the first beat of the second measure represents the first two eight notes. For three four, um, there should be three beats, three beats in every measure, and quarter note or quarter rest receives one beat. Okay, that is for the 3-4. Four. for the 4-4, four, four, again by definition, 4-4, four, four, there must be 4 beats in every measure and quarter note or quarter rest receive 1 beat. Okay, going back to this the three time signatures so if you can see there the two four the three four and the four four there is a symbol that i haven't introduced yet so that is in mathematics that is called greater than sign but in music that is called an accent so i placed an accent there just to emphasize something uh four two four the accent is on the first beat. For 3 4, the accent is on the first beat again. For 4 4, the accent is also on the uh, first beat. Therefore, an accented beat is in the first beat. So if um, 
in every time signature, the first beat is accented or the first beat is strong beat rather compared to the other beats. Those are the weak beats. Because um, accent meaning an emphasis, to show emphasis. So, accented beat is on every first beat of every measure. So, I will um, present again to you the three time signatures. And this time, please listen to the beat and try to observe if you can hear the strong beat. That's for the 2-4. Four. For the 3-4. And for the 4-4. Four, four. That's it. So from there, actually, if you know how to listen the strong beat or the accented beat in a music without looking at the musical arrangement, you can identify the time signature. How? By just listening to the strong beat or the accented beat. So you start there. If you, if you can hear a strong beat, you start counting one. And then if there's another beat, you continue counting. And if there's another strong beat, then that's the time you'll start again with one. So that's how you identify the time signature of a song without any musical arrangement or musical piece. So just by listening to it, by identifying the accented beat or the strong beat. beat. This time, how about 6-8? 6 8 as you can see there you can see um a lot of not just one accented beat in every measure so i will let you hear first before we will look into it so please listen okay i will play first So, in the 6-8 time signature, the accented beat is first on the first beat. And there is another accented beat that is found on the fourth beat. So, therefore, um, the 6-8 has two strong beats, the first beat and on the fourth beat. So, it actually, the, the second strong beat, the fourth beat, is not as strong as the first beat. So, if you will count the 6-8 time signature based on the beat, it's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. That is, for the 2, 4, 1, 2, 1, 2. For the 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2, 3. And for the 4-4, four, four, 1, 2, 3, 4, 1, 2, 3, 4. That's it. Um, you might ask, is there a difference between the 6-8 and 3-4? Because mathematically, 6-8 can be reduced into 3-4. So can we, are they the same? So this time, I will show you and let you hear the difference between the 3, 4, and the 6, 8 because my answer is no. They are not the same. So let's have this. Uh, okay. Here is a uh, rhythmic pattern for 3, 4. And also here is for the 6, 8. 
If you can see there, they have the same tempo, 80 beats per minute. For the 3, 4, 80 beats per minute. For us to really identify the difference, I uh, intentionally placed the same place position of notes there. The only difference is the time signature there. Observe, please observe. And for the 6, 8, still the same. So, I will play first how the notes is played. So, let's have first the 3, 4. So, that's for the 3, 4. For the 6, 8. If you can see, if you can hear and see, actually you can hear, you can see uh, that 6 8 is a bit faster. But if you will listen to the tune, they are the same. To give you more emphasis on the difference, I will play um, 3 4 first with a metronome so that you can identify really just by. Hearing it, the difference. So here's for the 3 4. So the counting again, it says. So that's for the 3 4. For the 6 8. Okay. It is a definitely not the same. Again, I'll play the 6 8. For the 3 4. Basing on the beat, the 3 4 is um, slow. 1, 2, 3, 1, 2. Three. While in the 6 8, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So definitely not the same. So hope you learned a lot today. So this is the end of our lesson, and this is Teacher Celeste saying bye bye.